David Sherborne, for Rooney, had been questioning Vardy, 40, about one of the fake posts Rooney posted on her private Instagram account as part of her Wagatha Christie sting. Mr. Sherborne misspoke and said it was Vardy who had gone to Mexico to look at gender selection, to which the model responded, it wasn't me who went to Mexico, it was Mrs. Rooney. The lawyer said, is that your best point? Verdi's lawyer Hugh Tomlinson QC then stood up and said, Mr. Sherborne keeps making remarks and if the witness is in the box for a long time it can be unpleasant. Mrs. Justice Stein, who is hearing the trial, said, it is unnecessary. She added the court did not have time for the remarks and cross-examination resumed for a few seconds before she asked Vardy if she wanted a break. Vardy nodded and grabbed a handful of tissues before leaving the courtroom at Royal Courts of Justice for several minutes. The courtroom had earlier burst into laughter over Vardy's response to a question about her agent's phone falling into the North Sea. The model, who is married to Leicester City striker Jamie, was asked by Mr. Sherborne about an article in The Sun by Simon Boyle which referenced a picture of Wayne and his children on Colleen's private Instagram. The court previously heard Vardy's agent Caroline Watt was unable to supply her messages between herself, Mr. Boyle and another reporter Andy Halls. This was because her phone had fallen into the North Sea during a boat trip. Mr. Sherborne asked Vardy, that article refers explicitly to a post on Mrs. Rooney's Instagram account doesn't it? I put it to you that that came from you through Ms. Watt to Mr. Boyle. Vardy said, no, absolutely not. Making reference to the phone falling overboard, the lawyer continued, the shame is Mrs. Vardy, that Mr. Boyle's WhatsApp messages with Mrs. Watt, just as with Mr. Halls, are lying at the bottom of the sea in Davy Jones's locker. Vardy responded, who was Davy Jones? As journalists and members of the public chuckled, Mrs. Stein told Vardy, it just means at the bottom of the sea. The court heard Rooney was very upset about the article and posted on her private Instagram account saying, the grass strikes again. Vardy then messaged Rooney describing someone who would leak stories as D-heads and said the son of all people, adding, hope you are okay. Mr. Sherborne said Vardy was fishing when she went on to ask Rooney, have you been through all your followers? No one with any celeb magazine links? What about being hacked? He said, it's totally disingenuous isn't it Mrs. Vardy? You know perfectly well you have been responsible through Ms. Watt, as we see through a number of these posts, to pass information to the Sun. Yet you are passing yourself to her as someone who hates the sun, coming up with excuses like maybe you have been hacked, maybe someone with celeb links. Vardy said, no, I don't say I hate the sun. Rooney, married to England star Wayne, accused Vardy of leaking stories from her private Instagram account in the now famous wag of the Christie tweet in October 2019. Vardy denies the allegations and is suing Rooney for libel.